you know, it's me, your little boy, something. I have this video to give us choosing ones today. <laughs> you know, you are not anointed to be like everybody. You know what I'm saying? You are not blessed to be like everybody. You are not favored to bow to them. You know what I'm saying? You are not favored to compromise. You are not in this world to accept failure because of the fact that people around you are failures. You know what I'm saying? The Bible says, Greater is he that dwelleth in us than he that dwelleth in them. You know what I'm saying? For I have called you out of darkness into that marvelous light. So don't accept what people say, bro. <laughs> because, you know, I, 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 there was a time that I was uh, opportune to talk with one of my friends. So this, my friend, was telling me, uh, you know, uh, people, uh, people were telling me that uh, this work is not good, this, uh, this work is not good, this one is not good. Because then I do used to work in a place where we select rubber, iron, etc., different, different materials. He was saying all this stuff. I look at him, I keep quiet. I said, why will you be trying or coming to the point of convincing yourself to believe what people say about you? How will you be or how come are you so addicted to the point where what people say bothered you, where people say become your own reflection, become your own what auction? How come will you be, you know, be pleased to be moved by what they say, even when you know that nobody accurately wants something good for you. He was looking at me. He said, that is why uh, I, I, I don't want to do that, that again. I don't want to do this thing again people because people are now coming to make me to understand that uh, I, I, I'm being cheated, I'm being this. I said, yes, you may be cheated, but you don't need someone to drive you. You need to drive yourself because Within you, you know what you want. Everybody may not know what you want. Everybody may not like what you like. So you have to identify that which God has given to you. Don't be moved by what they say because you have no idea who is absolutely jealous of what God has given to you. Because the anointing of God in you is totally different from the rest of others. Others may, may, may start in what in big fool. In a big word, in a big mold, but you may start a little beginning and end up great. So everyone's dream is totally different. He, he was looking at me. <laughs> I leave him, I walked away. Because the truth is that no matter how you try to explain to them what they believe is what they believe and what their you know what their credit according to Italy is what they have already credited to themselves. So the truth is this: you are called to make impact. The anointing that God has given to you. Is different from the anointing other people have carried. That is why Jesus said, we are in this world. You know, we are in this world. I have given you the authority that whatsoever you bound on earth will be bound in heaven. And whatsoever you lose on earth will be lose in heaven. Don't let people lose your dream. Don't let people lose to your word, your focus, your blessing that God has restored or God has put in on your way. On your way. Because not everybody have idea what God have yielded inside you. Not everybody have idea what God have deposited inside you. Nobody have idea what God have put in what inside you. So it is you versus you. So stop trying to convince yourself to accept what people say. Because what they say does not matter. It does not count. What people talk does not count. All that matters and all that count is you. What people declared about you does not count. So stop trying to convince yourself to end up as a failure. Because the world we are, like, we are today understand that the anointing in you is different from the anointing of others. The grace upon you is different from the grace of others. Drop in the comments and say, the grace I carry is the grace to make empire. The grace to correct error. The grace to make relevant. The grace to make generational what productivity. I'm not here to be a negative productivity. Drop it. I'm here to make a positive productivity. Remain blessed. May the Lord bless you.